Nextar uh, Celestron, uh, Nextar 5SE. This is the telescope uh, you will be using in the lab. And the reason it's a 5SE is this diameter mirror inside is a 5-inch diameter mirror. Okay. So well, let's talk a little bit about the parts of the telescope. First of all, you never actually touch most of the, the telescope parts. In fact, you almost don't need to touch anything except for this right here. This is known as the keypad. This will control your robotic telescope. And then the other thing that you will need to touch occasionally is the focus knob. And also, you may need to move and adjust um, this piece right here. There's little thumb screws. You may need to adjust this or you may need to remove the eyepiece, right? So we'll talk about that. So what are the parts of the telescope? So again, I mentioned the keypad. This is the main controller for the telescope. This is how you make the telescope move. We'll, we'll go over that in a minute. This is the optical tube. This piece holds all of the parts of the telescope together, including the mirror in the back, known as the primary mirror, and the mirror in the front, called the secondary mirror. Uh, the opening at the front of the telescope is known as the aperture. Now, typically, this telescope would have a cover on it. We've removed that already. This is the aperture. It allows light to come through. But you'll notice that there's a, a black piece in the middle. This is the back of the secondary mirror. I didn't need to touch that. Sorry about that. How about this right here? We have, you like telescopes? How about this? We got a mini telescope. This is known as the finder scope. And if you look right here, this is the end that you look through. Uh, if you can see, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see, look through the finder scope and you can actually make out, I'm not sure if it'll make it out or not, there is a little crosshair and that's used for aiming. So the aiming of the telescope takes place. We'll, we'll talk about that later. It's fine. We can worry about that later. Uh, and then we have uh, in the back of the telescope, the opening that allows the light to come through is known as the visual back right? And this can be adjusted. You can actually turn this and then adjust uh, the eyepiece location wherever you like it, wherever is comfortable. This piece right here, which is actually going to take the light coming out of the back of the telescope and bounce it, there's a mirror inside, is known as the diagonal. And the piece that you look through is called the eyepiece. Beneath this visual back, we have the focus knob, okay? And those are the parts of the Celestron Next, our 5SE. We'll be using it in a minute.